Hello and welcome to Reinfuse. Today we are playing Magical Chase on the PC Engine. Uh, now there's a very specific reason why we're playing Magical Chase and that's because it's considered to be the rarest game on the PC Engine. It tends to retail when you, if you buy it on auctions and such like, between $500 to $2,000. And yeah, it's uh, obviously pretty hard to find. Now, because of those two facts, as is probably quite apparent, I do not own the actual cartridge. This is playing off of a flash card, but it will obviously play the same way regardless. Uh, and one day, hey, one day maybe I'll find one and I'll be lucky and buy it cheap. So here it goes anyway. <laughs> well, straight away, that's an interesting uh, way of describing the uh, difficulty. Breezy, bumpy and rough. Well, we're just going to go with Bumpy. Halfway down. Ooh, that's... I quite like that. That's quite pretty. Oh, blimey. Little chicken men. And, uh, yeah, all of the bad guys require more than one shot to kill. See, straight away, what I, what I see in this is it's very reminiscent of Cotton. Uh, now, obviously, the reason for that mostly being that Cotton is also a, a scrolling shoot -em up that is very mystical um, and based around a witch. Uh, but it's also got very strange creatures as well, although that doesn't come close. I've got to say, this is the oddest. Uh, I'm going to put on some uh, turbo... <laughs> Auto shot on the, my controller. The good thing with the PC engine is that most of them come with turbo enabled controllers. That's definitely very good. Okay, so stores. So these are the little gems that you pick up. So you can also use those to buy stuff. I do like this. I, I prefer this to buying the games where you actually just have to pick up extra weapons and stuff. I don't know what half these are. Well, let's get the bulk and we can... Yeah, let's take that. Let's get out then. <laughs> oh, there's the cubes, right. Cubes. So is that kind of the boss character then? And that's why it was showing us on, on that screen. We've got to shoot the bit in the middle. Alright, whoa. Oh, blimey. Oh! Yeah. I'm really enjoying this. I'm doing about as well as I always do, but I'm really enjoying this. Oh, one life. Okay, one life. Yeah, so that's the boss character. So that's... Interesting. I've got, I, I think I've kept my power up by ball, haven't I? That's good, that's good. Even though there's one life, I've still got my power up. Yeah, and this really does burn through them. I love the little chicken-headed running things. <laughs> oh... Like the little balls when you shoot them, they explode. I want to try, if one of those pops up again, I'm going to try shooting the ball before I shoot the guy. See what happens. I just, yeah, it's, it's really nice. It's It looks really nice, it moves well. It's not too bullet heavy. I'm not going to bother with a shot this time, I'm going to go straight past it. I'm I'm enjoying my experience here. It's not an easy game by any means, but it's uh, it's fun. Oh, that's a different attack from last time. That's yeah. Oh, it's a bag. Let's clear the screen of some bad guys first before we. Whoop. It's got. A, I like the fact as well that the the Bosk has got a few different attacks, not just. Oh, 
Okay, I'll kill myself. <laughs> okay, that's going to be long enough for this game. But, yep, you know what? Definitely. Uh, obviously, it's a tough game to buy. Uh, the big shame is that it's worth buying. Because that's a fun shoot em up. That's, that's gone right to the top of my favourites, which means I really do have to try and find a physical copy now. And that's a tough ask. But, yeah, I mean... If you get the chance to play the game, then definitely take it. It's it's worthwhile. It's a fun game. I love the graphics. The sounds good, and it's just the boss that have that the one boss we saw obviously uh, had so many different styles of attack that it just used at different times as well, and it wasn't just a straight pattern. Yeah, I liked it. Good game. Definitely recommend it. Well, thanks for watching. If you liked it, please hit like. If you really liked it, please hit subscribe. If you didn't like it or you've got a comment to make, then please leave it below. See you next time.